Hey everyone, how we doing? My name is Tim Pongraz and this is Focus on Detailing. Today's video is going to be a relatively short one, but probably one of the most challenging videos I've done. And that's because I'm reviewing a towel. I really sold it to you then, didn't I? This video, you really want to go out of your way to watch it. Don't worry. I'll make a review about a towel worthwhile. So the past couple of weeks I've been sent some stuff from different companies, you already know about Jay Leno's products, I've started reviewing them and more is to come. But I've also been sent this drying towel from GT Shine, it's called the GT Twist. Whether these companies send things on a large or small scale, it doesn't really matter because at the end of the day I'm going to be doing my very best to review whatever it may be. These kind gestures work as a sort of a uh, I help you, you help me situation and at the end of it you get a video. So everybody wins. Now, going on to the towel itself. This rather large drying towel is 70 centimeters by 90 centimeters. It feels really good. It has the sort of low pile side for the glass drying and the higher pile side, which is 600 GSM, for the normal paint drying. When it was sent, it arrived here quite quickly and it also came in a sealable little pouch, which is a fantastic idea on behalf of the business because it'll help your towel last longer in great condition. I'm going to be making this video a little bit more informative than me just chucking this towel onto a wet car and drying it down. Anyone can do that. I'm going to be going into a little bit more detail into the drying process. Sometimes it's not as simple as just getting a towel and drying down a car. Sometimes it is, sometimes it isn't. But I'm going to go into a little bit more information. Unfortunately for the intro, there's not too much more I can tell you about this towel until I start testing it out. So let's get out there, wash this car and dry it down. I have my car here that has been already cleaned up and now being rinsed down again to really put this towel to the test. Let's get into the finer details rather than just wiping down the car. Would you believe that you're not safe from swirls even during the drying stage once the car has been meticulously cleaned? To minimize micro scratches, using a quality towel is only half of two very important things that need to be included. It comes down to one, obviously having the decent drying towel and two, a prep surface. Simply put, if the surface is lacking any protective layers, that leaves your paint open to being marked. This is stepping into what is very simple, but people still wonder why their car gets swirls. Obviously, there is more to it, including the washing, cleaning and correcting steps before, but I'm here to talk about drying. So, extra friction increases drag and will in turn make the paint more susceptible to those minute scratches. The towel will glide rather than just pushing water around. So you're probably thinking, what's the point of having a quality towel if no matter what, unless the paint is protected, it'll increase the chances of damage? Well, all of it works in harmony. Prep surface plus quality towel equals an easier and safer drying process. That protected prep surface will help with water beading and or water sheeting, depending on how the water actually hits the surface. If your car has something like a ceramic coating, you can likely use compressed air to dry your car. No towel needed, but that would then defeat the purpose of this video. All of this is a lot of rambling to some, so to put it simply, the less time you're touching your car, the better off your paint will be. A soft quality towel like GT Shines will stay plush for longer, the absorbent gentle material means more water to pick up, and the large factor means more surface area for an efficient drying process, and the less time you have to touch the paint, the less likely you'll install scratches. You can see as this towel glides across my car, it's picking up what little water has been left. A fantastic example of what I'm talking about. Minimal pressure, if none at all, when having the towel glide across. It sucked up the water from the glass and easily disposed of it from the paint. You'd definitely see if water was left behind on the black, but we're all good, leaving no streaks. Just out of curiosity, I placed the towel over my bonnet with then more water without moving it. Waited a few seconds, then lifted it. As you can see, a very simple task to remove the water from the surface with this towel. I'm loving it. From cheap to high end and high pile to low pile, I've used many towels, but this is up there with the best I've used. Would I recommend it to others? Well, for $32 American or $46.50 Australian, and for how well it works, absolutely. 
According to GT Shine, it can last up to 200 washes or 4 years, which is pretty amazing. Choosing a decent towel is a must, and if you're keen on looking after your car, look no further. There was no need to wring out GT Twist when I was drying the BMW. It could easily have kept going to drying down another car. Sometimes, as you can see, the towel can get marks on it, maybe from hitting the rubber or bits of the plastic across the car. It happens. So to clean this towel, simply place in a gentle warm wash with a safe, non-biodegradable detergent, separate to other dirtier towels with no softeners or bleaches. Then dry indoors to help it stay free of contaminants. If you're wanting more out of the drying process, add something like Bowden's own Boss Gloss or Ammo Hydrate to the damp towel and go over the car. It'll add more protection and shine. Really, that's it for this video. I hope you all enjoyed it and it was a little bit more informative than me just stating that this towel is soft and it works well. But I mean, it is soft and it does work well. Big thank you to GT Shine for sending this towel my way. Feel free to check out their social media pages in the links below. Thank you all for watching. Don't forget to check out some of my other videos and I'll catch you all later. I've recently been sent some gear, as you all- Some gear, that sounds like drugs. Anyone can do that. I'm gonna be going into a bit- <coughs> Today's video is gonna be a pretty short one. Probably. Probably. Today's video is gonna be- Seriously? If you can be my little sponsor dog, what do you reckon? We'll just put it like that. Maybe not. You don't like it?